decent for our children instead of cats and parakeets and dogs like Bosley, man. Bosley! Do Bosley! Bosley, come back here! You wait here. No, I'm coming with you. We do everything together. All right, come on, hurry up. Bosley! Bosley! Yeah, but it's a good hurt because of you. Oh, darling. I can't believe it. You're so beautiful and, uh... And what? Well, you're the first person I ever met that I really trust. Darling, just remember that I love you. Love and trust, they're the same thing. Mr. Pfeiffer is here. Who? Mr. Pfeiffer. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Well, bring him in. You may have to take notes. Mr. Pfeiffer, Mr. Quimby. Oh, how do you do, Mr. Quimby? I'm very glad. Mr. Pfeiffer, sit down. Uh, yes, thank you. Well, Mr. Pfeiffer, <clears throat> you've certainly come highly recommended. Highly. Indeed, highly. Oh, you must uh, be referring to Miss Barbara Fuller. Well, she may very well be biased on me. Uh, that is, but, uh, somewhat biased. Uh, we're friends. You're modest, Mr. Pfeiffer, but that's good. We need modest and intelligent young men, men to learn the mercantile business from the ground up. Oh, you mean I start from the first floor? <laughs> funny, funny. <laughs> Funny, droll. Uh, Miss Fuller uh, also spoke in glowing terms regarding your honesty. Oh, oh, yes, I believe that honesty is the best policy. Right, my boy, right. <laughs>